Hi, this is another one of my how-to videos. This one will show you how to make the pinwheel trinity knot. It could look as a starburst or as a little triangle as I have right here. See, you got a triangle going around the center point. So I have the blue wrapping around the middle. Then I have a little stripe going around the middle here. And I got a pink in the middle right there. Pink triangle. Okay? So as I undo this, I'm going to show you guys how to make this. It's a pretty cool knot. So this is what it's going to look like. So you guys are going to pop your collar. Okay? And it's going to use a lot of extra right here. So, I'm going to untie it. Watch all the steps in reverse. It'll help you get this knot very well. So, as you can see, I have my big end right here. My small end right here. Get your big end right where you're going to wear your tie. I usually like it right at my belt, but some people like it at the belly button. Whatever you see fit. So, you're going to make your little dimple. Wrap the small end around and through the back and off to the same side. Now you're going to wrap around the back, up through the middle and around. So you got a little Windsor right here. You're going to wrap around the front. up through the middle and through now this next step is crucial to success okay guys so see you really literally just have a backwards Windsor right here okay so you're gonna loosen this a little I like it tight but some people might like this not loose pull it to the left or on the back and up through now this knot is very difficult to pull off if you're going for the nice pinwheel triangle look ish uh, but if you're looking for a nice, nice look, see, see perfection right there. You, it'll take a bit of fidgeting to get it nice and perfect the way you want it. But once you have the knot you like, like see, I, I pretty much like this. You got a little pink triangle in the middle with the stripe going around. You tuck your excess tie. All the way around your collar. And bam. Go down. Tighten the, that nice tie up. And bam. Dress for success. That's nice. That's a nice tie right there. Right there, you got a nice tie. So, fidget around with your collar a little. Get this perfect. Perfectly up there. And sometimes you're going to need a vest for this. Because um, it might come out a little short. Because you might need a long, a lot of time. So you came out a tiny bit short, but it's okay. So that's how you draw, that's how you make the pinwheel trimming knot. It's a very simple knot, and I'm going to show you guys how to do it the other way right now. So hold still. This is going to show you how to do it the, pin, the um, starburst way. That was the pinwheel. Now, this one is really, really sweet. So, you start it the same way. 
Get your tie to your right place. Again, big big end is on the right, small end is on the left. Go over towards the right, up, and off to the right with the small end. You're doing everything with the small end. You're not even touching the big end. All you have to do is make the dimple and then you're done. Then come up through the middle. You can tighten as you go if you want a really slick, tight, tight feel for it. For it. Come across the middle, as you can see right now, and up through the top. Now this is where it's different than the other one. Remember the other one where we went this way? This time, you're going this way. Okay. Okay. Make sure I'm not losing you right here. Sort of a difficult part of this knot. So. See right there? See the blue is sticking out? This is definitely one that you'll wear if you're trying to stand out. Because this... This knot is insane. It's it's big, it's bold, it's saying, I'm awesome. I know how to tie ties. Anybody else have a tie look like this look like this? I didn't think so. So this tie is bold, courageous. If you're going out like with your friends, know how to tie this tie, because that's going to impress them. Okay? That's all I have to say. So, please subscribe to my channel again. Since um, from my last YouTube video, I'm pretty darn new at this, so I might be putting some more tie how-to videos up there. But I'd say it's a pretty good-looking tie. Okay, see you guys next time.